This tube will become the center joint of a flute. I'm checking for straightness, concentricity, and surface finish. Tone holes are made in two ways. To make the drawn tone hole flute, first oval holes are machined in the tube. Highly polished drawing balls are placed into the pocket of an arbor. We reach down, grab the drawing ball, and pull it precisely through the oval hole as it spins. Our tone hole is raised and later flattened and rolled. Solder tone hole flute is far more labor intensive. Each tone hole is machined from a tube and carefully fitted to the body. It's located into position and soldered to the tube with our signature gold solder. We then flatten and shape the top of the tone hole. Soldered tone holes are thicker than drawn tone holes and have the acoustical advantage of a richer tone. All additional parts, ribs, posts, and rings are collected and moved to the hand assembly bench. After holes are drilled in the rib, posts are inserted and carefully aligned. Ribs are strapped to the body and soldered. Excess solder is removed. Piccolo ribs are made in a similar fashion and screwed onto the wooden body. Posts are flat faced to fit the keywork. Stainless steel rods that will support the keys are hand fit between the posts. The barrel joint is aligned and soldered. The flute is now ready for keymaking.